And a very good evening, everybody. I'm John Cole, a standout volleyball player for the Coyotes, headed across town to begin her college career. And this gamer is looking forward to it. You know, at first, I thinking through, I kind of decided my junior year that I wanted to go to college here. Um, it's a good deal with the two years free. So after my senior year, Priz kind of talked to me into playing. I wasn't, I was iffy with my decision. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I got accepted at NDSU too. So now Priz is here I am committing today. <laughs> but you love college volleyball. You love to play volleyball. Good opportunity to take the next step. Yeah, I think it's, I think I'm going to really like my decision I make what se once season starts up. And Coach Caitlin, I am really, really like her already. So I can, can't wait to see what the future holds for me. Well, I see you at the games all the time, so that's fun to go and, hey, yes. I can play with these people. And I know pretty much all the girls already. I have a lot of friends in college too, so that's nice too. What do you think you have to get better at as you begin your college career? Uh, I think a little bit, um, tweak my platform a little bit, make that better, make me a good passer, better passer. All right, a gamer, that means I think it's someone who plays hard, brings it every night. We wish her the best and a lot of wins. Kellen Larson of the Coyotes claimed the Bismarck Roadway Wrestling title at 139 last weekend. Tonight we visit about the great win and what it means for him the rest of the year on the mats. Uh, you know, a lot of work. I just been, I've been grinding, really. I've been putting in a lot of work, and it's been showing, so, yeah. Hard work pays off. Yeah, hard work does pay off, and I just keep preaching it to everyone around me, so, yeah. If you can win a Rotary title, you can win a state title. I mean, that's how tough the competition is there. Yeah, there's a lot of kids there that are, you know, the, all the North Dakota kids, they play under me, and they're all going to be the ones that are at the state tournament, so I'll see them there. Huge for confidence. Yeah, huge. I mean, just beating the, some of those kids that are under me, it's, it's just a big confidence boost. How do you think you've grown as a wrestler this year? Uh, it's been it's been pretty good. it's been big really I've been I've been just show, like just showing crazy amounts of like improvement from what I'm doing. All right, really proud of him. The younger brother of Kyle football and wrestling standout Micah, who I actually ran into on Saturday at the Art working out, and he told me the good news about his little brother, the last Kyle to win a Rotary title. Well, four, and that came on that great state title team of 1999. Due to the weather forecast, Mr. Larson and his teammates will not be making the trip to Miles City this weekend to wrestle. Also postponed for tomorrow night, basketball against Jamestown. No makeup date for that yet. And hockey on Saturday. That contest will be played 6 p.m. on Monday here. That's Coyote Hockey moved from Saturday here to Monday here at 6 p.m. A great Class B boys basketball matchup tonight in Williston as Trinity Christian plays host to Alexander. Gomets unbeaten on the new season, 8-0. Williston's Class B team is 5-1. They tip off at 7-15. Going to be a classic Class B game. Bill Belichick, who guided the New England Patriots to six Super Bowl titles, has parted ways with the Pats, one of the greatest coaches of all time. Uh, there's seven openings, and he will be back. I'm disappointed as a Pats fan. Let's take a timeout. 